In this video, I'm going to show you a very easy way to do pixel streaming with Unreal Engine 5. So let's go to the website right here and you can navigate to the showcase section. Now here in the showcase section, you can check out some projects. So these are pretty big projects and let's check out this one first. So this will take some time to load based on your internet connection and stuff. And as you can see, this is running in my browser. So we have Nanite, Lumen and all that stuff. This is a fully fledged UE5 project. So let me show you how to set up your very own project for pixel streaming. So I'm going to demo this with a project that I have. So this is my project right here. So just open your project, go to project settings, make sure that you have your level selected here. After that, you can search for hardware acceleration and make sure that this is enabled. This is required for pixel streaming. So after that, you can go to plugins and we are going to enable the pixel streaming plugin. So to use pixel streaming inside Unreal Engine 5, you have to enable this pixel streaming plugin. After that, I'm going to add the player start object. And this is the position at which your player is going to spawn. Now we still need to define the game mode and player controller. So we will go to the world settings now. So I'm going to change the game mode to the first person game mode. You can see in my case, I have the first person controller set up. So once you've made sure that everything works in the engine, you can package this project. So go to package and we need to make a windows package and make sure that you are set to shipping and we're going to package this project. So I've packaged my project and after packaging a project, you will get a folder called windows. So you need to make a zip file of the windows folder. And this is the zip file that we need for pixel streaming. Now let's go back to stream pixel and here I'm going to log in. And after logging in, you can create your project. Here you have some additional settings as well. So this is the link to your project and this is how you access your experience. Next you have the number of concurrent users. And this is where we upload the file. After that, you have some UI options. You also have the option to enable your microphone. And after that, you have your subscription details. So stream pixel has a subscription service. So they charge you about 99 euros per month with two concurrent users. And unlike other services, they have their own servers. So this is really cool. The streaming times and all are pretty fast as you guys saw. So I'm going to upload my project. So after your upload is done, it's going to be in the review phase and stream pixel are going to manually review your build. So if you have some errors in the project, you'll be notified of those errors and you can update the project pretty easily. So after that's successful, you can copy this link and paste it in your browser. And as you can see, we have our project running in the browser. So this is pretty cool and I genuinely feel that stream pixel is a pretty good streaming service. I've tested a lot of streaming services and out of all of those stream pixel is one of the best in terms of performance and the price. If you like this video, leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. That's it. I'm going to see you guys in the next video.